these people. Yeah, I'm yes, you, don't I'm, do it. I know they're glad to hear that. All right, for many of us, <laughs> the retirement age is a moving target. Maybe you don't have enough money or you're just worried you'll be bored after your career. Ian, you sat down with AARP uh, for tips on working or heading back into the workforce. Uh, a lot of information here. Yeah, you know, 65 it used to be the magic number. Lots of us are living longer, working longer, many of us well into our 70s. So if you're planning on working past 65, it can get a little complicated. You don't just stop or you don't just keep working. I sat down with Dana Kennedy with AARP of Arizona to go over all the things we should keep in mind. Let's start with insurance. Are you going to go with Medicare? Or are you going to go with your spouse's health care? Or maybe your employer offers health care. If you're self-employed, you can get dinged for signing up for Medicare late. So you want to look into that. Pensions, Social Security, those also come into play. Kenny says it may be a good idea to hold off on dipping into those accounts. You want to kind of delay your Social Security benefit as long as possible so you get that full Social Security benefit. Since more and more people are living much longer than 65, 66, 67, you want to make sure that you get that full benefit. Yeah, try to let that interest work for you. If you're going to start working again, let's say you left the workforce, and you're coming back, there could be unexpected costs. Is that new job going to require clothing? You've got to have a uniform, maybe. What about a laptop? Well, gas isn't free, and we all know how bad traffic is. So do you really want to deal with that in the years you're supposed to be relaxing? Kennedy says happiness has a lot of value, too, in that new career. Really look at what you're passionate about, and if you can match that passion with something that you want to do. Because you're right, you might have had a very stressful career, and do you want to go back to a very stressful environment? Very good uh, tips there. Now, a skill set is something you may need in a new job. Technology is always moving fast, so you may need to brush up on some of those skills. Our website has some places that offer free or very, very cheap technology classes to help you along. Head to azfamily.com. We have a tab, CBS 5 this morning, uh, ASU, one of them. I mean, some of the classes are 15, 20 bucks. Yeah, And you can affordable. get some very, very valuable skills to kind of help you get going in uh, your new career path. And there's tons of options. Uber, you can work from home. There's right. many, many, you know, the, uh, this uh, Internet of Things and the global economy really offers up a lot as far as new businesses or stuff like that. We definitely give people a lot to think about. Yes. Lots to so think about. Digest all that. And, hey, maybe you're retired and 